Welcome or welcome back and I need help at C squared. In this example, we have an ellipse and we need to find the vertices and the foces. This ellipse here has a center at zero and zero. The form we see there tells us we have y squared and x squared. And also it tells us the focal axis is the y axis. Why? Because this 25 is uh, larger than 21. In this moment, we know the focal axis is the y axis. So we're going to use this equation here. And we're going to need to be careful a little bit with this form here. Okay. Okay. I'll tell you why. Okay. Well, first of all, let's find the vertices. And for finding the vertices, we're going to take that b squared, which is 25. And we're going to find b by taking square root of 25, which is going to give us plus or minus 5. So the vertices are uh, 0 and 5, and 0 and negative 5. And you notice these two points are on the y-axis. Now, if you use this equation here as it is, you're going to get the a c squared of negative 4. So you really kind of need to be careful with, uh, with this form. c squared is the difference between a squared and b squared, but you know, always you need to get a positive number. So in this case, it's going to be 25 minus 21. And that will be 4. So c is going to be nothing else than square root of 4 plus or minus, which is give you, giving us plus and minus 2. So now we know the foci of this ellipse. The foci are 0 and 2 and 0 and negative 2. Now we're going to see the picture here of this ellipse. Yes, these are the vertices. And these are the foces. Okay. If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click the like button and come back and see square for more help. Thank you.